Hey everyone, it's Xander, and welcome back to Metroid Prime. We're going to be getting on to more of my least favorite part of the game. Because I hate this part. Although it's kind of cool getting to revisit this area. This is the same, um... We're going to be re-exploring the same Frigid from the very beginning. Holy crap, I cannot see a thing. So it's gotta look terrible for you guys. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of falling down and stuff. What's that? That's raw fasin, isn't it? Can I scan that? Uh, well, let me scan that. Yeah. This is the ruined frigid. We have a lot of ground to cover here. There's an area up there, as you saw. We're nowhere near being able to get to that. So we're going to be exploring here instead. And this place is a lot harder to explore here. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to be going into thermal visor mode a lot because the lighting is piss poor. Oh god. Hi guys. Bye guys. Not expecting that. Oh, what the? The door didn't even open and you shot me through it! Hacks! Okay. Your turn. This is gonna tell me that's out of power and I have to power the conduits, isn't it? Yep. Get used to doing this. What have we here? Uh, I think these are one time scans only. Recording to the model. A Talon Crab. No comment. I'm just gonna move on. Underwater exploration, not one of my favorite parts. Great, more water. This place is totally flooded. Also, we're going to have new enemies here somewhere. We're going to have a lot of blood to put up with here. Alright, these are one new creature we're going to be seeing a lot of. Gel Zap. It's an aquatic predator. Basically, it opens its mouth, you shoot it in the mouth. It tries to draw you in. There's also supposed to be some aqua pirates in here somewhere. If I could find them, that'd be awesome. Because then I could just go ahead and shoot them. I even fall slowly. This area drags. It really does. Also, these. These are new, also new enemies. Aqua Reaper. Powerful tentacle, part of a submerged organism. Similar in nature to the surface based vine or reaper vine, the Aqua Reaper has adapted to a liquid environment. It shares the poor vision of its rock dwelling cousin. Relying on crude son uh, sonar sense to seek prey. I heard by water that Reaper has considerable speed and strength. Which probably means if I shoot it, it doesn't really go away. It just may retreat for a while. Yeah, that's all it does, is it just kind of goes away for a while. As you can expect, they're going to be annoying later on. Alright, I can tell you right now what you're going to want to do is go around in thermal visor mode and start powering conduits, because that's what this area pretty much amounts to. It's exploring in this view and shooting stuff to power things. There's one down here that I gotta get. This, 
this is surprisingly um, not too hard to navigate. I think this is actually better lighting than the default visor right now. That's saying something. I think going around this way is probably the best way to get my happy little metal clad ass up here. Don't put me... No, it doesn't. Okay, that's nice to know. Can I even make that jump? No, I can't. That's why there's platforms here. The biggest problem to remember when you're underwater is that you can't jump worth a damn. Never forget that. If you have to ask yourself, can I make this jump? No, you can't. I keep forgetting how to bail out into combat visor easily. I don't even know if they can touch me from up here. I prefer not to find out, damn it. Oh my god, I hate this place so much because it just takes so long. I'm not a fan of underwater segments in the first place, and you really feel the pain of underwater exploration right here. This whole video is just going to be me pissing and moaning about having to be underwater. And this is also very typical for a Metroid series. I'm assuming that I'm supposed to make that jump because I certainly can't make it to there. Oh, come on. Open up. Alright. Plan B. How do I kill this guy again? Because he's being obnoxious. Okay, not what I planned on, but you know what, it works. Pretty sure I need to go over there next. Yeah, because there's nowhere else I can jump to. Make sure you're at the edge of these platforms before you make the jumps. You're going to need every last bit of help that you can get. It's annoying. Words cannot describe just how annoying this is. You have to play this for yourself. Tell me I don't have any condiments down here or I'm screwed. I think there's only three that you have to hit. Make that four. Wrong beam. Yay, I'm so smart. I can go through there. Get the hell out of here. Not really. This just gets me out of one annoying room and then I gotta go to another one. Also, I should probably take this up as high as I can while I'm here. You, buddy, open up. I want to shoot you. In the face. Yeah, he likes to do that and completely screw you up. That's what I hate about them. They suck you in. So, of course, when I make all of that progress and get so high up, picks the worst damn moment possible. I'm going to be surprised if I get out of this room by the end of this video. What am I up to it? No, I can probably get out of this room. So we go from me being quiet to me being pissed off and annoyed. Sounds about right. Ha! 
How are these platforms just hovering here? And once again, how do physics work? I've gone from uh, Suck at Sakamoto to How Do Physics Work. Whatever. Right, if possible, I'd really like to get back up here. Don't fall. I think I can make this. What did I just say that if you have to question it, you probably can't make it? I was wrong on that one. Thunderwater jumping is actually surprisingly not too bad once you get used to it. Thank you. Oh, you again. Nope. We're not doing that again. What's even up here? Because I can't see a damn thing. I feel like I should at least go to the top so I don't have to come back to this room later. Oh fuck, no, 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 no. Haha, <laughs> lucky! So lucky. All the way at the top here. That's I don't think I can do a damn thing about. Is this the door I came through? I'm gonna feel retarded in a second. Oh my god. All that for nothing, right? So where's that door I powered at? Over here? Awesome. Let's just quickly go there and try don't miss everything. Don't mind me, I'm just crying a little bit on the inside here. I hate this room. Are you guys enjoying my pain and suffering right now? Yes, good. Because someone needs to be entertained by this bullcrap. Oh, I know I'm heading towards it. Get out of my face. Blah, 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 blah. Bite me. I know. I'm heading there. I'm working on it. That thing's gonna go off at me probably two more times before I make it to the gravity chamber. Maybe I can get up here this way. Yeah, rush roll wasn't that big of dicks. Slowest progress in the man. What do we have in here? Great, more conduits. Alright, I think this here is going to be a save room. Yeah, that's a save room. Might as well use it. At least I got out of that pass place. <laughs> now I don't have to go back again. Until I find some stupid reason to go back again. There'll be something. I don't know what, but there's going to be something. Just get used to this view. Seriously. Oh, that's dirty. How do I get to that? Concussive blast. Like this? I love it when they just hand it to me.
What was that message said about power suit augmentation device? Did it say I can't destroy stuff that helps me? That's kind of funny. Also, I... How do I get through here now? There's supposed to be a way up from here. I know there is. It's the, like, only way to go. Power suit augmentation required to advance. I came all this way for nothing. Let me turn back. So apparently I jumped the gun and came this way too early. What a surprise. Will you open up? Alright. So I'm going to do a smart thing for a change. Take a look at Fendran and Drifts and figure out where I've not gone through. Where do I have ice beams that I can access? In the research core. Which is... Oh. Is there a fast way out of this place? Like, seriously, is there an easy way to just say fuck it and leave? Not really. You know what? I'm cutting this part here because it's going to take me a while to get out of this fucking room.